Hello everyone, welcome back to another video from Somos Biology. This video is another mnemonic video trick video regarding plant nutrients. The plants require nutrients for its survival and they require major nutrients as well as micronutrients, macronutrients as well as micronutrients. We are not bothered about the micronutrients much but in this video I am going to tell you a mnemonic to easily remember the function and importance of major macronutrients of plants. How to remember that? Because this is a part from unit 12 or unit 6. You can consider for CSI and life science unit 6 plant physiology or in unit 12 plant tissue culture. This nutrient part is very very important you need to remember that. So for that I have this mnemonic for you. First of all uh, that NPK ka message. So you say ka CA message. So this is the first sentence as a mnemonic that you need to remember. NPK ka message. NPK is a name of a person, the short form of that. We always know that there are short forms like that. So NPK ka message. Instead of K ka, I write it CA ka for a reason. And then the second sentence that we have is uh, the Pratap enjoys framing while photo of Pratap. So Pratap is kind of a self-obsessed guy. That's what I uh, remind myself to remember this. It's a self-obsessed guy. So Pratap enjoys framing wall photo of himself. But I write it like Pratap enjoys framing wall photo of Pratap. So Pratap wants to see his own photo laminated and framed and hang to the wall. This is something that I remember. So two sentences, NPK ka message and Pratap enjoys framing wall photo of Pratap. If you remember both this sentence, then it will be super easy for you to find out the function of the major macronutrients. And these are the macronutrients list. Let me write it out. N, nitrogen, P, phosphorus, K, potassium. Apart from that, Ka, calcium and message Mg for magnesium, N is for sulfur. So these are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, Six. Six macronutrients, major nutrients for the plant nutrition. The list is given for you. NPK ka message, you know, NPK, calcium, magnesium, sulfur. That's it. And then we have this sentence. We will utilize this sentence to put uh, uh, the name of the function of these different macronutrients in our brain. Starting with Prata P, P for protein synthesis. Prata P R A pro protein synthesis. So, the first macronutrient that is N, nitrogen, is involved in the process of protein synthesis. Alright, so the protein synthesis is done. So, Pratap, first pro for protein synthesis for nitrogen and at the end we also have Pratap, that is also protein synthesis. So, I may write it here, protein synthesis. So, protein synthesis starting, ending in protein synthesis. In the rest, we have 4 in the middle. So, Pratap, you can see the TA, ATP, TAP, yes, enjoy this TAP or ATP. So, P for ATP synthesis. So, phosphorus is needed for the ATP synthesis in the plant. Then we have enjoys. K for enjoys, enjoys, here would be enzymes. Okay, enjoys enzymes. Clear? Then we have wall, capital W here is wall, wall for cell wall cell wall synthesis and during cell division, plant cell division because cell wall is synthesized during plant cell division. So calcium is needed for the cell wall synthesis of the plant and cell during the cell division of the plant. And magnesium last photo means involved in the photosynthesis, photosynthesis. Why? Because it helps in the formation of the structure of chlorophyll. Okay. As they form structure of the chlorophyll, then magnesium is involved in the process of photosynthesis. That's how you can remember, Pratap enjoys framing wall photo of Pratap. So, Pratap PR for the protein, starting with the protein, last end in the P, Pratap for protein. In the middle, TAP, ATP, ATP synthesis for phosphorus, enjoys enzymes for potassium, then wall, calcium, cell wall formation and cell division, and then photo. Photo is photosynthesis, chlorophyll production, that is magnesium and obviously that is how it ends, right? Six important macronutrients from nitrogen to the sulphur and their role 
in the plant development, in the plant growth and survival. For maintaining the plant physiology is clearly mentioned. I believe it has a clear idea for you. If you like this video, please hit the like button, share this video with your friends, subscribe to get more and more videos like that in future. Thank you.